Is it good? Hey guys, so it's day one of my week in our life of a medical student vlog and I'm with Mao here, my acquaintance. I'm hurt. I'm hurt. I'm hurt. <laughs> Actually, no, I'm kidding. She's my friend from college and my schoolmate since elementary school and we just had brunch at Beyond Plants and now we're on the way to get... We're on the way to get... Coffee! Coffee, we're on the way to get coffee. Oh my gosh. We're currently here at the Rizal Boulevard and Dumaguete City, so... Backstory, I was stuck in Cebu for months and now I'm finally home and I underwent 14 day quarantine, I underwent um, PCR tests and now I'm out, I'm out and about. Yes, he <laughs> is. Stay at home, stay at home. So after brunch, Mao and I decided to head to the coffee shop and stop by Slum University on the way there. I haven't been back in more than a year. This is where I graduated and spent most of my academic life. If you're watching this video hoping to find out how great my life is as a medical student, you're probably in the wrong place because it's really not that great. I'm a regular student who likes spending my time at coffee shops, highlighting my books and notes, adjusting my calendar for the week, and going on Twitter and watching videos on my study breaks. We ended the long afternoon buying some snacks and eating it along the beach. Before going home, I went with my parents to the hardware store to buy some stuff. Just kidding. <laughs> mm -hmm. I did some notes on Notion and I tried my best to be as productive as I can. We were preparing to go to a birthday dinner with my friends from college and this was a close thing and we were all wearing masks. I'm with my college friends today. Hello. It's a Monday and I have class today at 9 and I'm already wearing my uniform. I went down to get some coffee for Joshua and I and I'm back here at the study area. Wow! These are the things I bring in my bag on a usual day of studying out. First off, I have my wooden sturdy book stand my friends and I bought on Facebook together with about one to two textbooks depending on how many we need to read that day and I also have a pencil case from Minisaw together with my zebra mild liner highlighters and some random stuff from Shopee like some sticky notes and some flaglets I use on my books, my pens and pencils and sharpeners and of course my iPad Pro and my Apple Pencil. I have accepted that this is going to be my life from now on, that I'm going to be studying every day again. I just finished a day of lectures, so I had one in the morning and one in the afternoon. So this is going to be my schedule for the rest of the week. We have one morning lecture and one afternoon lecture. And this week, we're learning about physical diagnosis and physical examination. And our exam is going to be on Monday next week. You paid it enough.
We just finished the day of class. <laughs> I'm so tired. I just slept the whole afternoon. I was running late for my 9am Zoom lecture and when I arrived at the co-work space, it was still locked and I was so pissed off that I had to attend the lecture somewhere else. Hey Josh, how was your first SGD? Tiring. Tiring. Draining. Look very it's, it's a Thursday and Joshua just finished his first BBLB and I only have pre pre-recorded lectures today so I didn't wear my uniform. We just got coffee and we're gonna be studying until 5 p.m. and then I don't know. The global pandemic has truly affected everyone worldwide and especially to us students who have to work extra hard to adjust to a new normal and to an online educational system. As medical students, we don't have patients or cadavers to practice on at the moment, but we have to adjust because, you know, adapting to difficult situations should come naturally for us future doctors. That was my week as an online medical student at the Cebu Institute of Medicine and since we're quote-unquote self-directed learners, it's up to us how to manage our study time at our own pace. With that, I deserve a nomad night after a long week of lectures and studying, so see you in the next video and thanks for wasting your time.